Have you ever wanted to preserve flowers to enjoy them after they've bloomed? Artist Thomas Cole pressed flowers both to have souvenirs from places he visited and to have natural specimens that inspired him. He pressed these plants for his herbarium, a collection of dried plants. The plants in this herbarium page came from Shakespeare's Garden in Stratford-upon-Avon, collected in 1841. To press plants at home, you'll need some paper towels and parts of a plant that are okay to cut. Make sure you have permission to cut the flowers you want to cut first. Preserving and pressing flowers requires pressure and removing the moisture from the plants. There are several ways to do this. If you have a plant press, like this mini flower press with two pieces of wood sandwiching cardboard and paper, then you can use that. But if you don't, you just need paper towels, heavy books, and several days for the plants to slowly dry out under pressure. Or, if you have a microwave, you can press flowers quickly with a sheet of notebook paper, paper towels, and a heavy kiln brick, tile, or microwave-safe ceramic dish. Start by collecting flowers. A scientific herbarium would preserve flowers, stems, and leaves. Let's start with the slower method of pressing flowers in a press or with heavy books. Unless you want to keep the stem, trim off the stem as close to the flower as you can. Place the flowers between two paper towels. Place several heavy books over your flowers and leave them for several days. Once the flowers are dry to the touch, they are done. Now, for a faster method that also dries and presses the flowers, we'll use a microwave. Again, prepare your flowers and place them on a piece of paper. Put the flowers and paper between two pieces of paper towels in the microwave. Add your heavy ceramic object over the flowers. Microwave for one minute to a minute and a half. If you are using large flowers, you may need to microwave for longer, 30 seconds at a time. Carefully remove your brick or tile with oven mitts or a pot holder and check the flowers. Gently and carefully peel your plants off the paper. Look for our video on what to do with pressed flowers for some ideas.